What's up YouTube and welcome back to some more Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 Campaign Remastered. This is an achievement slash trophy slash collectibles guide for all of the intel throughout the campaign. That's 45 different pieces of intel. We will get two achievement slash trophies, one at the halfway point of the video for collecting 22 pieces of intel, and one at the end of the video for collecting all 45. There will be timestamps down in the description, and I will be having a counter in the bottom left hand corner of the screen so that you can follow along. The in-game counter is a little bit off, so when that pops up on the screen, just ignore it. So the first mission in the game is SSDD, and there is one collectible on this mission. After completing the tutorial and before heading into the pit, make sure to go and grab this right across in this building here. Now it won't actually be here because I grabbed it off of recording, but I promise you this is the location of our first collectible. Now we're on to the mission team player, and there's two collectibles in this mission. The first one is right here as we're about to exit the school, and then the second one is actually going to be right outside of the exit to the school, and you are done with this mission and have gotten three collectibles so far. Our next mission is Cliffhanger, and there are three different collectibles on this mission. The first one is just before you start to infiltrate the base to the left here, you're going to want to head up the ladder in front of me and pick up the intel at the top of it. After you infiltrate the base and plant the C4, you'll need to regroup with your teammate, and as you come down here to meet with him, instead of heading directly to him, which is the objective marker in front of me, you want to turn around and come back here, and you'll notice a piece of intel right through this window. Go ahead and smash open the window and grab the intel. At the end of the mission, you'll control this snowmobile, and you'll be about 1,800 meters away from your objective as you get to these trees right here. Go ahead and slow down, and you will should notice a piece of intel on the ground. Just drive over it to collect it. Now we're on the mission Takedown, and there are four collectibles on this mission. As soon as you enter the favelas, just continue along the path that I'm taking forward, and then head diagonally across here and into this building to find your first piece of intel. A little bit after that area, you'll be making your way through these kind of tight corridors. You'll have some more enemies to fight through. Be careful of the civilians. And as you come to this staircase, you'll notice that ladder right there to the right. Clear out some enemies and then head up this ladder, kill the enemies in the room in front of you, and then grab the piece of intel off the table. From here, we're going to want to fight our way out of this building and then make our way across the alleyway into the next open building and in that first floor will be our next intel. Near the end of the mission, you'll make your way up onto the rooftops, you'll have some more enemies to fight through, and as you continue here, this is all forward progression, you'll come to these staircases, which you're going to have to go up both of them, but before continuing forward after them, make sure you head into this brick building to our right, clear out any enemies, and head downstairs to find your last collectible on this mission. We are on to Wolverines, and there are four collectibles on this mission. The first one is going to be inside of this gas station as you come into the open area that you're going to start defending. So just clear out the gas station and grab the piece of intel that is on the counter. Now like I said, the rest of this area is pretty wide open and you need to defend the sports bar right there. But first we're going to head over to the Burger Town and grab the piece of intel that is in the dumpster out back. Uh, 
Then from here we want to go over to the taco shop, break out one of the windows, and jump into the taco shop to find your next piece of intel. Finally, from here, we want to go to the opposite side of the sports bar to the bank, and we're going to find our final piece of intel on this mission. That is number 14 out of 45. The Hornet's Nest has four more collectibles, and after you make your way through the first fight, instead of following your teammates down the street, make sure you head into this building right here and pick up this piece of intel. A vehicle will pass by here, a bunch of enemies will hop out, you'll fight some more enemies going down this street and into this kind of courtyard area, and as you make it to the opposite end of this courtyard, you'll be able to find your next piece of intel just to the right here on some barrels. In the next area, you'll need to fight your way up this street past the ice cream shop right here. And as you make your way up the street, you're going to notice this car to the right. That's the blue car right there. Just head on into this building, head upstairs, and pick up the piece of intel on the table. Our final collectible is located near the end of the mission. You'll come out to this soccer field, and just behind the net on the opposite side is going to be a window, which will automatically break after a little while, and you can grab your laptop. Now we're on to Exodus, and there are three more collectibles on this mission. You'll come to Garden Villas a little while after leading the Honey Badger through the suburbs, and right in this first building on a table is going to be our first collectible of the mission. A little further down the road you'll come to this checkpoint and you'll need to kill a bunch of enemies here, but then as you start to move through, head into the right side of the building and you will find another collectible on a table. Finally, after you cross the first bridge with the honey badger, you're going to come into some more suburbs, and you want to head to the second building on your right, this brick building over here, and head upstairs fighting through whatever enemies that you need to to find your next piece of intel. Now we're on to the only easy day was yesterday, and there are three pieces of intel on this mission. After breaching and clearing the first room, you're going to head upstairs with your teammates, and before heading back out onto the deck, make sure that you turn to the left at the top of this staircase to grab this piece of intel. Later on in the mission, you'll breach and clear another room and set up a trap for a bunch of enemies, clear out those enemies, and then head into the room where they spawn to find this piece of intel. And then just a little bit further on, you're going to fight through some more enemies, and you'll need to head upstairs. But before doing that, make sure to come over here and find your piece of intel just under the staircase. The Gulag has four different pieces of intel. The first one is located here just before you head on inside. Make sure to come up this staircase and at the opposite end of the room you will find your laptop. Now after entering the building and fighting through some enemies you should come to this like comm center or whatever and just behind the screens will be your next laptop. About halfway through the mission you'll defend an armory area and then you'll be let out of that area and you'll start moving around the gulag. As you come to room 327 right here, head on inside and grab this piece of intel. Just before the end of the mission you'll have this little cutscene and right when you gain control make sure to turn to the left and grab this laptop before continuing. We have two more collectibles to get on the mission of their own accord. As you head into this building and come through the lobby, you're going to notice these elevators. The second elevator on the left will be opening and closing. Head on inside to find your piece of intel.
You'll make your way upstairs in this building by climbing up some rubble, and as you come up here, go ahead and start clearing out the enemies, and as you turn this corner, you'll notice that brown door directly in front of us that's closed. There's an enemy behind it who you can shoot in order to get the door to open, and then head on inside to grab your piece of intel. There are three more pieces of intel on the mission contingency. As you make your way through the forest, you're going to come to this area with the pipe next to you on your right side, and you'll notice directly in front of you where that dog walks past, there's a parachute stuck up in the tree. Just under that is going to be our first piece of intel on this mission. After reaching the submarine base, you're going to want to head into building 33, which is directly in front of you. Fight through the enemies here and into the kitchen where you're going to find your next piece of intel. Then leave the kitchen and we're going to head up to the helicopter pad in order to find our last piece of intel on this mission. Just fight through the enemies and make your way up there to grab it. We have skipped the mission's second sun and moved on to Whiskey Hotel as second sun has no collectibles on it. Whiskey Hotel has two of them and the first one is located on this couch after leaving the Oval Office. And our second one is located towards the end of the mission. This is all forward progression as you'll make your way up these stairs. And just before moving forward to end the mission through that doorway, turn to your right and grab this piece of intel. On the mission Loose Ends, you're going to be storming Makarov's safe house, and all three of the collectibles on this mission will either be inside or around this safe house. So the first one is located upstairs here. After breaching through this door and killing some enemies, you'll find it at the back of the room. Now from here we're going to head down into the basement and we're going to breach the door that's on the right side of the hallway, kill some enemies and make our way into the armory in order to pick up our next collectible. And finally for this mission, head across the hall and breach this door, which you're going to take out some more enemies through this door, and then you want to walk all the way outside and down to that boathouse where our final piece of intel for this mission is. There are two collectibles on our next mission, the enemy of my enemy, and the first one is located right at the beginning here. If you just hop out from where you spawned and head to this cockpit, you can grab this collectible. Then near the end of the mission, you'll notice that my objective is about 100 meters away from me and I'm making my way across this street. You'll notice this cockpit that's on fire, head on inside and grab the collectible near the staircase. There are four collectibles on the mission just like old times. The first one is right at the beginning. As you head into the cave system, you need to let some guards walk by and then take out that guard smoking and head to his right to grab this piece of intel. In the next area, you'll make your way through a steam room and get attacked by a bunch of enemies. And before heading through the wall, make sure you turn to your left and grab this piece of intel. As you make your way back into the cave system, you'll come to this open area where there's like a big hole in the roof. And before going across, make sure to come over here to the right side and pick up this piece of intel. And near the end of the mission, you're going to get to this door that you need to breach. Go ahead and breach the door and eliminate the enemies and there will be your final collectible for this mission on one of the tables in this room.
Now we are on the final mission end game and our final collectible is located directly in front of us before getting onto the boat right at the beginning of the mission. You will get your achievement or trophy right here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it helped you. If it did, be sure to have a like, comment, subscribe, share, favorite, all the fun junk, check down the screen, and also links some awesome things, my Twitter, Instagram, Mixer channel, a bunch of other things you might be interested in. Keep it here for more achievement slash trophy slash collectibles guides, more Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 campaign remastered, and until tomorrow, ta-ra.